I was born and raised in Kansas City, Kansas. In 2017, I walked away from a basketball scholarship from Kansas City, Kansas Community College to pursue a career in music as a singer-songwriter. Singing is my life. There's no feeling like being on stage doing what I love to do. However, it's not always glitz and glam, baby. This is work, but with the help of my mom and my team, I'm certain I have everything I need to take me all the way to the top. So today's a pretty big day for me. I have a really big show. I'm opening up for Young M.A., so that's super cool. So my stylist, Tamara and Tasha, came over to give me my outfit. They do an amazing job when it comes to like styling. I love that brat necklace. Thank you. I need, I had it on silk like 60 hours at this mall Yeah, so you just I need like to get this look. look. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. And I can yep. see it with them, with their damn jackets. Uh -huh, Cause the, the black will match their, yep. the mm -hmm. girls. Uh -huh. It's perfect, I love it. I like it. Okay. okay. I'm all oiled up and whatnot. You definitely oiled up. <laughs> okay. That's cute. That's it. This is their stuff. Okay. Their denim jackets and the two dancers, both of their shirts. I showed your mom how to put them on because it has an attachment to it. Okay. So all hands go up in attachments together plus the shirt. Okay, cool. Yep. Yeah. And so and then they have their bottoms and their black bottoms for the guys with the jacket open, no shirt underneath. Okay. And then the girls, the black tops. Was it black? It was black. Um, joggers, joggers. You wanted it a baggy look. Yeah. Yeah, I right? think I don't know. If, I they might be doing shorts, like denim shorts, just regular denim shorts. Okay, that'd be fine. Because it's, it's supposed to be hot. Okay, that's fine. Too. So like, I, I think she they're bringing both. That. Okay. She yeah. Remember, she said, "What about denim shorts?" And we said, "Yeah, that'll be too." Uh, yeah, because uh -huh. it's supposed to be hot. So they're bringing both. So okay. just in case. So, yeah. Okay. Thank you guys so much. Yes. Good luck tonight. Have fun. Be careful. You are eating the barbie. Mm-hmm, girl. Hmm. <laughs> Let me get you security. Mama! She, she went to print, print something? Oh. Mama! I'm trying to show her your shoes. Oh. Mom! Come here real quick. Yeah, because I'm doing the splits. Yeah, that's cute. Oh, are you? Oh, yeah. are you going to jump up and hit the split? Well, because we, we, we start from here. Two, three, four. Oh, and then we go one, two, three, four. Here. That's perfect with the shorts. Oh, I wish I could do that too. <laughs> <laughs> you got knees too. Um, yeah, but that's perfect with the shorts. Uh -huh. You gonna try to do that on stage? No, we are. We are. Okay. So it goes one, two, three, four. One, oh, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. The dancers. Oh, okay. Three, four, and then it into the splits. Yeah. Is this yeah, doing yeah, a chart where you're not singing? Yeah. Okay. Because <laughs> I'm like, seriously. Oh, I'm just actually concerned, like. How are you gonna sing through all that? <laughs> yeah. So then, yeah, you're gonna crimp. Yeah, I'm gonna crimp. Or try to flutter. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. And then just pull it apart, you know. Yeah. And kind of take so, it. I'm a, yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. Yeah. I'm gonna crimp them and then I'm gonna spray it so that I like won't go nowhere. And then yeah. pull it apart and then, like, yeah. taste it. Taste it. So, that way. so when you're moving, it gives you that big, like, mm -hmm. you gotta take it by. Yeah. Yep. So, alright. Oh, she wanted to show you these. Oh, yeah. These oh. are the shoes that I want. She said she's gonna hook me up. Okay. I'm gonna try to find them for Chicago. Yeah. Those are cute. Oh, they're so bad. Are those a different pair? Yeah, different pair. We got them one off. Hey, you'll be balling. All right, family. All right, thank you. No problem. See you guys later. Thank you so much. Uh, take pics and send them to me, please. Yes, yes, yes. girl. All right. All right, we got to make sure I take some And you, that, will you guys send Elena an invoice or, or whatever, what she owe, what I owe you guys? We're, we're paid. You sure to you guys? We just paid like two, three days ago. Oh, okay. I'm I'm like, I don't know. Yes. <laughs> My name's Yvette. I am Maya's mother and ma manager. Um, my job is to make sure everybody else is doing their job, making sure she's got wardrobe, the dancers have wardrobe, making sure everybody shows up on time, make sure we get sound checked, make sure everybody is taken care right, of. All right, Maya, it is almost four o'clock. Yeah, I know. So we have to leave by six. All right, I'm taking a separate car though. Okay, but I need you. Okay, do you have the address to the barbershop? Yeah, you sent it to me. Okay. I made sure you sent it to me. So I wouldn't forget it. So you actually, because you have a problem with not answering your phone. Yeah, where's my phone? Can I have this salad? These are, yeah, you have it. These are the ones I'm going to give out. Okay.
got your name on that sleeve. All right, cool. You like? I do like. So, and I forgot to tell them, we can tell them when we get there, when we get these out. I told them we're going to do it doing the freestyle. Okay. All right. The pop-up. We're taking the pop-up. I know you don't like the picture, but we got to have it. So we're going to use it. So I don't even care anymore. Y'all don't be listening to anything I got to say. What do you I mean don't care what you got to say? If I say I don't like something, oh yeah, she doesn't like it. Let's use it anyways. But I'm just saying, you know, we have these. We pay for them. They were 80 bucks a piece. And, and then, then nobody tell me to fix my necklace. Like, nobody cares about your necklace. You, th you think somebody's going to be like, oh, her necklace was Yes. You no, they're it. not. All you going to look at is your neck and your picture. It's going to be soft. <laughs> she trips over the stupidest stuff. Like, somebody's gonna be actually paying attention the way her necklace is turned. They're gonna be looking at her face and they're gonna be looking at her name. If anything, they're gonna be judging what her hair look like. It's just, she's so nitpicky and such a perfectionist. It kills me. <laughs> they can take their phone, they can take a picture of it so they can find you on social media. That's what it's about. <laughs> My mama always saying I'm worried about the wrong stuff. But, listen here, okay? My necklace was messed up. And like you like when you're taking a picture, everything has to be perfect. So why would the necklace be messed up on this big old poster so everyone can see it and the necklace is messed up? Like it just doesn't make any sense, but you know, to each his own. But we just trying to do what's best for you. Yeah. You know, if you don't like it. I'm gonna grab some water and stuff to take. Mm. And some just snacks. Bring your deodorant, get your bag, bring your... No, I know it's bring. Okay. I'm sick of this. I'm sick of what? This conversation. No, I had to go to the store. What's up? Huh? You, you looking for me there? Yeah. No, I'm not there yet. One of the videographers is supposed to ride with you, but I don't know if we actually told you that when you were gone. Oh, uh, okay. So I'm gonna get in. How are you gonna get in where? To the show. Your name's at the gate. You go to the gate. All right. Give right. them your name. Everybody's All name right. should be up there. All right, cool. And if it's not, you need to call Street King. All right, cool. The rail with the burgundy trim and it's immediate. Hey, Chica. I'm driving to the concert. You're filming? Yeah. Oh my god, I'm on camera. Uh, yeah, you're on camera. Where's your audition for? Um, it's for some... What is it? It's for some commercial. Uh-huh. I don't know, for real. But I'm surprised they called me back because I thought that my tape was so bad. I didn't even want to send it in. Uh -huh. I told the agent that I didn't want to do this. <laughs> what? Why didn't you want to do it? Well, because they were asking for a gymnast. And, like, you know how to tumble, right? Um, yeah. I sent them, you know that video I put on my Instagram? Yeah, what you flipping? Yeah, the I part? sent them that. Maybe that's all they need. But a job is a job. You need to build your resume. So, I wouldn't ever yeah. turn down a job. And then you meet the producers, you meet the creative directors, you meet all those people, and you develop develop a relationship with them. And then you, and then all of a sudden they'll just start booking you directly. You won't even have to audition. That's also true. Trust me, I've done this. Well, we're headed to the Young and May concert. I'm gonna go live on Instagram. I'll try to tag you. She performs at nine, so just try to watch out for it. So that's gonna be seven o'clock your time, LA time. All right, I'll text you later when she's about to go on. Okay. All right, love you. Love you too. Congratulations. Thanks. Bye. Bye.
list, but they don't, unless they're an artist, you don't get anything, like a wristband or a pass or anything. We just check you off our list. So that's what I'm saying. If you don't go and come back, give that everything. What I am telling you is, once you in, you can't come out. That's what she said. We are supposed to meet at the barbershop at 7 o'clock. You have to get dressed. 7 o'clock. That's in 10 minutes. You have to start paying attention. Oh, I swear to God. She don't listen. You, you need to come out so we can go to the barbershop. Once you go in, you cannot come out. Is what I'm telling you. What? that I have to keep a schedule. She's trying to go see her little boyfriend perform. She needs to get back to get changed so she's ready for her own event. And I swear to God, if she hang up on me one more time, I, I just came with her. She's been giving me trouble since the day she was born. Whew. She don't freaking listen. She better hope she let her out. She kept asking me what I was doing and she kept asking me to come outside and I kept telling her that I'm ordering chicken and fries. So if I leave the building, I'm just leaving the chicken that I paid $15 for. And she wasn't, like it wasn't clicking. Mind you, she's standing right outside. She's right outside. She could have literally just walked in there, but she didn't. So I'm just like, you know what, I'm not gonna continue to sit here and talk about the same thing for 15 minutes when you're literally right outside the building. Like, she just told us that she was I just asked her. I said, if I'm performing, can I leave and come back? She said, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. What's that? Uh, uh, Mexican okay. Bridge Store just oh. opened up Hustle oh. Island 101. So got a 30 27 okay. prospect. Okay. Just a year and shit, you know what I mean? Okay. 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 I just can't be blowing up my phone yelling at me like, I, I'm, well, cause you're the artist, I gotta keep up with you. I was literally in there getting food. And you keep blowing up my phone like you don't know where I'm at. something they didn't say to meet them at 7 they said be here at 7 30. I don't think I'm a diva but I promise you I'm not look I'm not a diva I just get very very hangry when I haven't eaten all day and so I had already tried to have this nasty salad from Zaxby's and it just wasn't hitting. I just wanted some food before I performed and my mom's acting like she don't know where I'm at. And that's very much frustrating. So I don't know if that's called a diva, but hey, charge it to the game. <laughs> So this show's on 18th and Vine and they really didn't have a dressing room for us since it's an outdoor event. So the director's cut is a barber shop that's right off 18th and Vine. They were so gracious enough to let us use this barbershop so that we can change into our wardrobe, uh, in and out of our wardrobe before the show and after the show. Ah, yeah, sister. Yes. What's up? I'm Oh, 
place. That's all. That's the only thing ever. It's my job. It's my job to keep up with you and make sure you're on point where you're supposed to be, when you're supposed to be there. So my mom has this thing where she's always looking for me, but I'm literally in the same circle as her. For example, when I was getting chicken and she was yelling at me, blowing up my phone, she was all of 30 steps. 30 steps. Okay, yeah, you don't stay put. We're going to What's up, love? Where you at? You go to like nine. Well, yeah. If you're on 18th Street, you can get on a wall, huh? I said you may be able to get that credential to Tory now since he's already up there. Oh, if he did, he get his credentials when he got up there. No, he doesn't have anything. But he's just already in there. Right. Yeah. Just let him stay there. Yeah. Just let him stay there. We'll just give him to her. Yeah. Yeah. No. What'd you say? Um, uh, Mama, where should where did Anna go? Mom, where does Anna go? She's gonna have to share credentials with us. Okay. Did any of you guys need a ticket? Did somebody need an extra ticket? It was Zen. Did you need an extra ticket? No. Uh, no. She her name is down there. Okay. Is she Taylor? You Taylor? Yes. Yeah. Okay. You're not answering my question. Where does she go? Uh, where does she go for what? To like park. She's on 18th Street. I don't know where she's got to park. She just has to find a place to park. Yeah, just find a place to park and walk up. If she comes behind the building, like behind the juke house. You're getting dropped off. Just get dropped off uh, by the at the juke house. At the juke house. So my best friend Anastasi is coming to watch me perform. I'm super, super excited because she's literally my soulmate. She's so supportive. I love her to death. Shout out to you, Sazi. I love you. She's a model. She's so stunning. And everything about her is just amazing. So I'm excited to see her. Now I'm about to send you my location. I'm about to send you my location. No, uh, sort of. Yeah, I'm a singer, so we're just like documenting everything. Yeah, for my show. Okay, you from here? Yeah, I'm from here. What's your name? Maya Goods. Yeah. Maya Goods. Period. Oh, I'm not even Maya. Okay. Oh, that's a great oh, name. Period. 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 <laughs> I love beautiful black women. I just really do. I don't know who them women were, nor do I ever think I'm gonna see them again, but shout out to y'all, because y'all energy was so great. I just love it so much. Saz! Sazzy! Example B, always wondering where I'm at, and I'm 30 steps away. <laughs> I'm just like, hi, Mom. Hi, Sauce. How are you? Good, how are you? I'm good. Mr. You look great. Oh, thank you. Oh, you look amazing. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you. Ready? Yes. Ready. Ready. Yes. Good. Yes, sir. Get it. Get it. It's showtime. It's your favorite supermodel Ooh. and superstar, of course. Sazi and Guts. Literally, everybody say woo! Everybody say woo! That's a weak ass move. <laughs>
Oh, he just went back. All right, Maya, we, we can head up. Yeah, she's supposed to be up there at nine. to do their job and keep control of the crowd. I think there's probably like five more people ahead of Maya. She's like one of the main um, openers for Young MA. So he's trying to keep the crowd from backstage and it's like herding cats at this point. Okay, so I don't know what the issue was here or why they kept telling like the artist to like move back. I don't know. It was very much irritating. But shout out to Makaya because he was very sweet. I love him. We went to high school together. Okay, I'm about to just go stand over there because she said I got four or five people in front of me. Four, four or five. Four or five. Four or five. Four or five. Don't stop me from twerking. You just not. <laughs> if I'm twerking, I'm twerking. And what y'all finna do about it? Nothing. <laughs> cut out a song or only do a verse and a hook of each song. I don't know why. I guess because they were running out of time, but they shouldn't have let people perform twice is what I'm saying, so that's weird. And not to mention the fact that they sped up my song by 10 BPMs. So like, that's kind of shady because what if I didn't rehearse it like that? Actually, I didn't rehearse it like that. So what if I went on stage and just completely butchered the entire show because y'all sped it up by 10 BPMs and didn't tell me? Okay, so we're doing a verse. Hey, hey, where's where's Alyssa? Where's Alyssa? Alyssa did a sign. Yeah, can you go tell her we're only doing a verse and a hook on the first song? Okay. Yeah, go run, 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 run. For what? 
but we're only doing a verse and a hook of situation shits because I don't know what to do. I would have just said no, honestly. Honestly, like, I don't, he looked like he really needed it to happen, bro. Because they're, they're supposed to close at 11. Like, this whole thing's supposed to be done at 11. But he should have let all those people perform. Exactly. That's what I'm saying. I really have a choice. Everything's supposed to be shut down at 11. show love because like it just gives you this warm genuine feeling when people like actually show you love and support for the things that you're doing I think it's amazing the people who do show me love I love you guys so much it never goes unnoticed and that just goes to show that like when you have like an actual genuine energy like people will gravitate towards you and that's what I love about performing Overall, the show was amazing. I had so much fun. Everybody who contributed and everybody who came out to support, I love you guys so much. Thank you so much. It means the world to me. Thank you, thank you, thank you. But overall, yeah, I had a really good time and I wanna do it again. M-I-Y-A-G-U-G-G-S on all social media platforms and download all my music. I love you guys, thank you so much. Shout out to my dancers, they are amazing. Shout out to my dancers, they are amazing. Don't 
next time on Maya to the Top. Maya and the team kick rehearsal into high gear to open a show for hip-hop recording artist K-Camp. Okay, but well, don't worry about it, Maya. You know how your dad is. There's, you, you know, you can't let that stuff bother you before a show. Yeah, I know, but like, he never comes to my show. I didn't even get a picture. I gave him a picture. Good job. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. I'll let y'all know. Yes, all of. Oh. Kate Kemp is downstairs. Kate Kemp downstairs. You better keep your butt downstairs. Come on, Dorothy. This is your moment. This is your moment. And you drunk, that Let's grab her shirt. Come on, girl. I know you're not about to go see Kate Kemp and then flip flop. What channel is it going to be on?